Memorial Day. Memorial Day is originally known as Decoration Day. It's a federal holiday in the United States for honoring and mourning the U.S. military personnel who died while serving in the United States Armed Forces. From 1868 to 1970, it was observed on May 30. Since 1971, it is observed on the last Monday of May. Many people visit cemeteries and memorials on Memorial Day to honor and mourn those who died while serving the U.S. military. Many volunteers place American flags on the graves of military personnel in the national cemeteries. Memorial Day is also considered the unofficial beginning of summer. The first national observance of Memorial Day occurred on May 30, 1868, then known as Decoration Day. The holiday was proclaimed by Commander-in-Chief John A. Logan of the Grand Army of the Republic to honor the Union soldiers who had died in the Civil War. This national observance was preceded by many local ones between the end of the Civil War and Logan's declaration. Many cities and people have claimed to be the first to observe it. However, the National Cemetery Administration, a division of the Department of Veterans Affairs, credits Marianne Williams with originating the idea of strewing the graves of Civil War soldiers, Union and Confederate with flowers. Official recognition as a holiday spread among the states, beginning in New York in 1873. By 1890, every Union state had adopted it. The World War turned into a day of remembrance for all members of the U.S. military who fought and died in service. In 1971, Congress standardized the holiday as Memorial Day and changed its observance to the last Monday of May. Two other days celebrate those who have served or are serving in the U.S. military, Armed Forces Day, which so earlier in May, an official U.S. holiday for honoring those currently serving in the Armed Forces and Veterans Day on November 11 which honors all those who have served in the United States Armed Forces. A variety of cities and people have claimed the origination of Memorial Day. In some cases, the claims relate to documented events occurring before or after the Civil Wars. Others may stem from general traditions of decorating soldiers' graves with flowers rather than specific events leading to the National Proclamation. Soldiers' graves were decorated in the United States before and during the American Civil War. Other claims may be less respectable, appearing to some researchers as taking credit to that evidence, while erasing better evidence, bands, or connections. Land of the Free, Home of the Brave. Happy Memorial Day, America!